And we're back to SCP Containment Breach. 173 is directly behind that door. And he may open it at any time. So I shall save. I have opened it. I have instigated his attack. And he's moving over to my direction. So... I guess I can go around him. Yeah? Ja? No? No. No, no. 173, no do that. You no do that for me. No, I get I still can't move past him. But I could. Hey. 173. I'm over this way. Okay? Now, you're gonna stop being a dick. And I'm gonna go over this way. And you're not gonna follow me. That's how this is gonna go. So don't try doing anything that Santa Claus wouldn't do. Since Santa Claus is pretty picky about what he gives to Sadness for their Christmas presents. So you better be on your best behavior. Apparently level 3 is enough to get into 106's lair. So we definitely need to recapture him here. Wait. I just realized something. Wait. Huh? The, what the heck? Where is he? What? Oh. Oh. Uh, no, no. No, no. Guys, look at this. Okay, look look at this. It's... Si but it's saying he's there? He's there. Why? Why? Screw you, you douche. Because 173 is about. I'm I'm so angry. I'm so angry 173 is here. I'm gonna break the femur of the next person I see. What's this button say? Femur Brie Car. Does that mean free ice cream? I think so. Pretty sure that's Russian for free ice cream. This isn't free ice cream. This is painful scream. Shut up! I have a level 2, a 3, and a 4 keycard now. And I can't even hear 173 over this guy screaming. And I don't really care about his screaming, so... I can't even hear myself over his screaming. All I'm doing is waiting for 106 at this point. Sound transmission's off. Come on, 106, do your job. You know what your job is. Oh, now I hear 173. Thank you for shutting up. Okay, now... On... And... I don't know... I'm gonna save... Mainly because I'm afraid 173 is gonna, like, glitch through the wall, or something. Sound transmission off. Get... He's... Is he down there? Is... Oh my god, he is down there! I didn't even... I didn't know he could go down there! Do... Why and how is he down there? I... I just... I don't know, man. I just don't know. There's no real purpose to actually being down there. There's nothing for you. So, like, unless I... Unless there is something, but I highly doubt it, I guess. I'm just gonna look over this way, then close the door because 173's presence makes me nervous. It really does. So now we've recaptured SCP-106, we can... He's nearby still. We can move on with our lives and find out what's in this room. Oh! Yeah, it's 079. Oh, I said 076 earlier, my bad. I, I can't even remember what 076 is. I know it's something that I know of. Huh. Well, that's specific. Something that I know of. I 
think it's like Abel. Maybe Abel. I don't know. Sometimes it's hard to recall every single SCP by its exact number. There are some of the easier ones. Oh. Oh, it's you. It's you. I've done 11 parts of this video already. And you have not sang once. You're gonna sing, okay? You're gonna do your thing where you sing. You're gonna sing. He only sings if you look away from him. Do it. Do it. Ugh. Do it, you bitch! Okay. I'm gonna calmly ask you. Please play your sousaphone. Okay? I'm gonna get on eye level with you. I want you to entertain the viewers with your sousaphone. Okay? Okay. Okay. Go do it. Go do it. Alright. Go do it. Okay. Maybe you want a little privacy. I'll just come back and... Um, yeah, da 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 uh, uh, uh. Ah. Okay. We're gonna come back to you. Just a second. There's no real need to deactivate the silo. There is a purpose to being here, though. I can activate that one guy. And we are going to immediately ring it without hesitation. And if that wasn't enough, I'm gonna so to ring it again. Ring it again, I don't care. Who cares? I don't care. Ooh, maybe the sousaphone duck wanted me to play this for him. Alright, we're gonna play a duet. Cowbell and sousaphone. The perfect combination. Come on. Do it. Play it. Please play your sousaphone. You always do it off camera. Please do it on camera. Please do it. Cowbell again? No? Are you sure? Are you sure, Ducky? Oh! Oh! He played it! He played it, but... Hang on. Let me... Let me get the entire thing. Because if you look back at him, then he stops. Play it again. Uh, uh. Playing? Come on. Uh, uh. There we go! Finally! Now then. Um. We can go. What? Oh. Aww. That means bad news. Hmm. Well, I've been over there, I think. No? Yes? Maybe? I can't. I don't really know at this point, but I haven't been over the yonder direction. And, well, eh, uh, mm, eh, let's save. Let's save and man up face our fear of statues like a man, like a true hero would do, and he's right over there, I know it. Wait, what? What? Whoa! Huh? Whoa. 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 Huh? What? What the? What? I don't. Oh, uh, do What? What? Um. Okay. Um. That aside, I'm pretty sure I'm not going anywhere. No, nowhere important. It would seem dead end. Nah, the virus. We're gonna save here. Because this is going to be the infection. The thing I wanted to go to, but I only had a level 3. Also, there's something here. I'll read it off real quick. Uh, okay. Connection error, connection error. Uh, unknown, denied. Unknown client, please state your identity and the reason to the denial. In case that message goes through, evacuating 008 surveillance room. 
Incineration and irradiation system not functional. Apparently disabled by an unknown client. Do not enter 008's chamber before it has been confirmed safe. So, that roughly translates out to run up to it, completely ignore the hazmat suit available, and just take a deep breath. Ah, oh, hmm. Man, I feel funny. I feel pretty funny, like a virus going through my veins that is infecting my entire entity as a human being. As, hmm, you know what sounds really good right now? Human brains. Doesn't, doesn't sound, sound good, you know? I mean, zombies. I'm not a zombie, I'm a human. I'm a human. The virus is already starting to affect me. Oh no! No it's not. You will know when the virus starts to infect me, and so far it hasn't, so let's... Uh, appears we haven't gone this way, so instead of not going this way, let's go this way. Is there anything over there? I thought it's just a dead end. Um, hmm, well... Let's go over this way first, because I don't want to spend all the time- Oh, maintenance tunnels. Okay. Okay. So, we already saved in that room. I don't want to save... Like... What was that? I heard a voice. Did you guys hear a voice? Like, did he say, what was that? That's what I said. But, it's kind of weird. But, yeah, I don't want to save... After I have the virus, only to find out that there's no cure. So, I'm going to have to take this for what it is. And completely expect the unexpected. We are in the maintenance tunnels. However, 106 hasn't spawned? What? Is 173 down here? I thought I heard him for a second, but I'm pretty sure that was just water. Um, okay. 106, not found. Error! 106.exe, not found. Okay. So, what do I do about that? Up, up, up. Uh, just making sure nobody crept up on me. Aha! Now we, now that we do have the cure, wait, pick it, pick it up. Oh, I don't have enough room. Normally it tells you when you don't have enough room. Origami, gonna have to sacrifice it. Medical kits are important in this game because of how scarce they are. I think there are like a total of two in any gameplay. Luckily, this one is actually being nice. It hasn't spawned 106 or 173. But I probably jinxed all that. Probably gonna spawn directly behind me somehow. Let's just uh, go in the corner. Uh, not make any noises. Run to safety, or at least partial safety. Oh. Oh, that voice is a virus. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, no. The disease. The disease. What What do I do? Oh, I feel better. Okay, I'm gonna cut this real fast. I uh, gotta see how long I've been recording. Uh, see you in a second. Maybe goodbye and all that, but... Um.